What's going on, y'all? You already know, man. It's your boy. I'm back again with another video for y'all. So, anyway, in this video, I want to explain what exactly is the stock market. Stock market is basically a place where businesses come to give shares of their company in order to get investments, right? To put it in a very simple layman's term, let's say a company called John's Fishing. So John Fishing needs to buy fishing rods uh, to give out to the employees in order to pull more fish, to make more money, and all that good stuff, right? So let's say their company is currently, before trading on the stock market, is worth about 100000 meaning the building, all of the stuff they have, all of the assets they have is worth about $100,000, right? They can take 10% of their assets, excuse me, split that into 10,000 10, shares and have it initial public offer, which is when you see the stock goes public for the first time, they put it, they listed on the stock market, John Fishing, ticker symbol JF, is now providing 10%, uh, 10,000, 10,000, uh, 10,000, 10,000 shares for their initial public offering and people are buying these shares depending on how much you think now the value of the company goes up by how much people are buying the stock how popular the stock is and how much people are willing to pay for it so if initially the 10,000 shares are going for a dollar each and people are buying them up fast meaning that the value is going up now the 10,000 out of the 100,000 that the whole company is worth now let's say it goes to that one dollar goes up the shares goes up from one dollar to two dollars so now that stock that that stock is worth two dollars a share meaning the initial ten thousand dollars that they had used to provide the initial public offering is now worth twenty thousand dollars which means that the value of john's fishing has now gone up by ten percent from it was a hundred thousand dollars they provided ten thousand in the initial public offering but we bought it up and now it's worth two dollars a share so that ten thousand dollars worth twenty thousand dollars and now 20,000 is still part of John's fishing, which makes also the whole thing go up, uh, which makes the ignition, yeah, which makes the whole company value go up. So that's all a stock is. I know sometimes people think like, oh, stock market is fake and stock market is fake and it's not real, it's not, no. I would say, at least the companies I invest in, every company that I invest in, I know honestly where the way their headquarters is physically located. I know where the building is. I know not personally who's running the company, but I can look up the person's name who's running the company. I know it's a real company. So, I mean, <laughs> it, they're all real companies and this is just how company make money. This is how company make money and by them making money that way, by choosing to go out to the public in order to get money, in order to uh, grow their business, you get to be a part of that journey with the company and that's how you get to make money. By you being a part of that journey with the company, growing and making money, you get to be a part of that company. You get to be a part of that company and you get to make money. By being a part of that, so back in the day, like in the early 1900s, when you bought a stock from a company, they actually gave you a piece of paper, a certificate with your name on it and with your share, say, okay, you own 1% of John's Fishing. I believe still to this day, you can't get that if you want to go through all that, like get the initial certificate saying that you own a share of this company, but I don't really think that's worth it to go through all that. But yeah, and so sometimes some companies also by you owning shares of their company, they do what's called a dividend payment. A dividend payment is just by sharing a small piece of the profit. So just like I said, John Fishing went from $1 to $2 a share now. So now they're, let's say that happened over a year, right? So that means they made a 100% return on that $1 because $1 was worth two. So 100% of $1 is $2. Um, so let's say they made a 100% return on initially how much money they have put out is worth, uh, how much money they have put out and how much the value has gone up now, right? So out of that $1 of profit that they've made, they could pay you a dividend. Let's say the dividend is, uh, Dividend could be five, uh, five cents on a dollar. So five cents on a dollar, um, 
Yeah, so for every dollar you invested, for every dollar share you bought, you would get paid five cents. Now, to some people, that's like, oh, that's nothing. Yes, it is something. Because the thing about the stock market and all this is about, is not really about, it's how much shares you own. If you own a lot of shares, that's a lot of five cents. And also, let's not forget, while they're giving you, it's not like they're giving you the five percent, the, the five penny, the five cents of your dividend payment and the rest of your money is just gone. No, your money is still with the company growing also. So that one dollar that turned into two, three years from now is worth four dollars, five years from now is worth ten dollars. The whole time your money was growing the whole time and you're still getting paid this five this five, uh, this five cents dividend, depending on some companies do it per month, some companies do it per, uh, per quarter, and some companies do it per year. Per quarter is every three months. Every three months is a new quarter. So there's four quarters in a year. So you're still getting paid in dividends and your money's also growing with the company. I mean, speak is a, it's a beautiful thing to me at least. But anyway, man, just wanted to make this video a lot shorter, give you a lot more, um, give you more information. Uh, we can all win with the stock market. I will keep explaining stuff with the stock market and just talking about stocks in future videos, man. We can really all win. I love y'all. Y'all be great, man.